The crazy thing about old cars is it's often the cheapest, smallest, most insignificant parts that cause you the most trouble and stop you getting home. And a great case in point is this little chap, the condenser, which is basically just a posh car industry term for a capacitor. And the mad thing is nearly every old vehicle has one. If it has an old Lucas distributor, whether that's a car, a motorbike, or even a tractor, chances are it has one of these inside it. And the problem is because of the way they're put together, because of the way that they're built, they can fail. And that's you coming home on a recovery truck. So first we need to understand what the condenser actually does. So as I said, it's a capacitor, which means it holds on to charge and then releases it when it's needed. So it's basically there to suppress the unused spark from the points during the firing cycle and they handle a lot of amps so when they're not working the points will open and close but the condenser or the capacitor in this case won't be able to release that spark and that's that and that's you coming home on a flatbed if you look at how they're made you can start to understand the problem they're not an expensive part the retail on one of these is 395 and if you look inside you can begin to see some of the issues first of all this little capsule this foil capsule sits inside and an end cap goes onto that the problem is, as you can see, there's movement there. That cap is not pressure sealed. There's no tension on that. Now, as these move around, they vibrate, they can get hot, and the seal in there and the efficiency of the contact can reduce. The other thing is you actually look at what it's made of. If you get one of these out and open it up, there's the other problem. They're very, very low tech. All that literally is, is a roll of foil and mylar. If I actually open it up, you can see. So there you go, look, it's literally just a roll of foil and mylar. That's all that's given the contacts, all that's transmitting the spark effectively to your engine to ignite the fuel to get you home. It's not difficult to see how that can break down. It's not difficult to see how it could be made better using modern technology. So what the guys at MGOC have done is precisely that. They've done a modern version using the latest technology. All of these are handmade here in the UK. It's a metalized film capacitor and it's what they would have done 40, 50 years ago if they'd have had that level of technology at the time. And what's great, as you can see, just goes in any old Lucas distributor, the 25, the 45, it fits pretty much in precisely the old OE position. It's very simple to fit, it will fit in minutes. And you've then removed all of that worry, all of that doubt, all of that movement that you can get with the older design in something that pretty much is a fit and forget item. Just put it in, never worry about it again, particularly if you've upgraded your rotor arm at the same time. And one of these is 14.95, one of these is 3.95. I think I'd spend the extra 11 pounds and get home from a tea on time.